Poyo. How's it hanging, Internet? Looks like we got some more ass creed. It's gonna keep this gravy train going. Try and beat this fucking game. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's gonna take a while, man. This seems to be a really, uh... It's a really long game when you get distracted with all the side shit, you know what I mean? That's the thing. It's just all the side shit. It's really distracting. But whatevs. Internet, how you doing today? I have nothing else going on. My weird ass day is mostly to a close. And it's about time I chilled out. I took it easy. Mm, hang on a second. Damn, what the hell's happening here? Oh, I think my phone exploded. Maybe a little bit. Alright, whatever. I'll worry about it later. Mm, poof. Timing is so off on that damn thing. Let me try that again. Poof. That's a little bit better. <laughs> so everything that happens on the computer is like delayed by almost a full second. I hate that shit. I hate it, but that, that's what I have to do for the PS4. That's what the PS4 demands. I have to fucking make everything come in way late. It's just part of the deal. Internet, what are you guys up to today, huh? Just chilling out? Not doing much? Doing whatever? Whatever, whatever. Oh, man, I'm tired. It's just really hot these days, you know? Hot days. I gotta go do that shit tomorrow with my buddy. Like, I'm not really looking forward to it. <laughs> it's just kind of trash. I mean, it's not trash. It's just not really what I want to do. I gotta stay home and play the video games. Well, what can I do? Guy needs somebody to hang out, and uh, I haven't hung out with him in forever, so why not? I think I'll just have to swallow it this time and deal with it. But, you know, I got my coworkers that want me to come in on Saturday and do like a luau or some shit. Man, I don't want to do that. I want to stay home and play fucking video games. It's too hot out. It's too damn hot. I just want to go to sleep and stay asleep for a nice long ass time. That's Really, that's all I want to do. Even, like, right now, that's what I want to do. I don't even really want to play that much. I want to go to sleep. And just sleep for a very long-ass time. But, you know, you're not going to be a streamer with that attitude. So I have to, I have to eat shit and just fucking, just be, fucking deal with it. Just have to deal with it. Just got to eat shit and deal with it. Not that big a deal. I'm alright. This is, you know... Morning sucks. It's really awful. I'm so tired. I'm gonna change my weapons, too. We had a pretty good time running around yesterday, but... We're gonna go back to the tried and true. Where's the, uh... Where's that weird shit? Damn. Oh, it's weird. Yeah, this stuff. Hack and slash from the mirror blade. Ooh. Jutens. Whatever. Mm. These look kind of cool, actually. How do they look in the hands? Eh. Eh. Weird. I don't quite like them. I think the other ones are a little cooler. Mm, yeah. The hack and slash, it's got adrenaline and critical hit damage, and it's higher than the adrenaline and combo multiplier. I wonder what the multiplier is. Eh. It's probably nothing. What's my main weapon? I have CP. I have two different C people's blades. Wow. Why is that? Hmm. One's level 18? Let's use level 18. Oh, wait a minute. I fucked up. Hang on. You need to be the hack and slash. And you need to be the, the sea people's blade. That's weird. Sea people? <laughs> Some sort of lost blade? Hmm. Critical hit and a German movement. Now, this is a little bit better, like, itemized, but... Whatever. Did I get anything cool for this one? A little bit.
Might as well clear out some of this shit, you know? No real reason to keep it. I'll just level up the hack and slash so that it's buffer. Spade of all trades. Maze. Uh, don't really care to carry these. We'll get rid of these guys. I was really underwhelmed by the animations. I want to keep uh, one of these. Probably made its way from Kirpros. Hmm. Mm. Combo multiple. Oh, we'll, we'll keep the other one. The other one's got combo multiplier. What about you? Level 13. Wow. We'll keep the plume. That looks kind of dope. Critical hit and critical rate. Hmm. Nice. Alright. We'll keep some of the other shit just the fuck around with it. I don't think we got any better shields, do we? Oh, maybe we do. What am I using right now? This is uh, level 14, Agent Prince. I got another one. Ranged and Adrenaline on Parry. Wow. It's a lot better than the other one. Quite a bit better. Melee Resist? sure which one to go with exactly. We'll just do a uh, age. I, I like the, the Prince one, so we'll do that. Damn, I had another one? Jeez. I don't think there's any real need to sell at the moment. Cool. We might have some shit that I can level up with. Ooh, I still need some leather for that one, though. What's this? A tool pouch? Eh, who cares about that? Bracers? Melee damage? Mmm. We can do one more. What do you want next after that? Eh. Alright, one more. Just because it looks kind of cool with the upgraded. Mmm, what else do we got? Can't do stabilizer gloves. Do the quiver. Hidden Blade seems better. Damn, this is looking crazy. Jeez. Handyman. Oh, man. It's really getting up there now. What about you? We can do at least one. Can we do another one? Oh, yeah. Could do another one if we wanted. How much is that going to do? Eh. Not really worried about that. I'll let that go for now. That looks nice, though. We got some pretty cool-looking gauntlets. We got a nice, uh, weird-looking blade here. Man, I can't even tell what kind of blade that is. Hmm. We'll try and rock these for a little bit. <laughs> Not quite as easy to use as a shield, but... We'll use it. did you see the sandstorm? Come the Darude Sandstorm? Us, yeah, I did. It was good. We all like Darude Sandstorm. Internet, what have you guys been up to tonight, huh? Ugh, I tried to throw some I'm ice into my bottle of Gatorade. <laughs> yes, make it, it up here, buddy. Come on. We saw bunches and a hyena and Ugh. so much sand. <laughs> <laughs> Enough <laughs> sand to fill a lifetime. That is why we need so many to help us Ooh. with our great work. And what do you promise I them? I reorganize my shit here. My Parcel leg is killing me. Man, my leg is... My That's ankle's getting better, but Just it's still kind of swollen. House. I don't know what the deal is. It is no I might have to actually go to the doctors. We must all I don't want to, though. I mean, it's feeling better. Doctors. It's just... No, I use it for a while, and then it feels like shit, so... I don't know. It is... I hate to going to the docks, father, though. Koa. It's not my kind. It's not my idea of a good time. Never really liked it. Mm. Let us have some honey dates now. And are you all right, by Damn! What happened? Uh oh! I'm been poisoned. Are you unwell? Damn! 
Damn, he smirked at him. Oh, man. Did I just get betrayed? Did I just get backstabbed by my own brother? How are you going to do me like that, son? Jesus Christ. My own brother. I can't believe it. We were supposed to be tight. We were like that. Now I'm all fucking doped up on butt hash and... Am I going to be buried in the sand now? Yeah, there's my big bald head. Just like that fucking skull over there. Damn! Whoa! I got out? Free yourself from the sands. Uh, hey. Senu. I, uh, where are you, my love? How do I do this? I am failing you. How do I get you out? Please, don't. It won't let me out. Again, I need a Darude Sandstorm to save me. Oh man, come Soon on, your arm I is up. Walk the outer darkness with the hidden one, leading me into the field of Ritz. I can't. Nothing's happening. <laughs> what the hell? Ooh, I'm having visions. Dark Souls. What the hell is that? Is that a human effigy from Dark Souls too? Uh, stab it. The fuck? He just wave at me like, hey, how's it going? Whoa! Hey, my bird! My bird will save me. Yeah, right there. Uh, my bird is totally not saving me right now. My bird is pretty much telling me to go fuck myself right now. Come on, man. I can't tell the bird to go get the... Oh, jeez. Come on. You got an arm out? I can't tell. Sometimes he, like... Your horse! Of course! Of course, the horse! I forgot about the horse, of course! Fucking, why was I thinking the bird would help me? Get my fucking horse! <laughs> the fuck? Get over here! Bird! Damn! Damn, the bird swapped him in the ass! Oh man. <laughs> Jesus. God, smile upon you. How nice. <laughs> Dude, that rock on the left looks like it has a dick. Did you see that? <laughs> the rock on the left looks like it has a dick. Stripped of armor, weapons, and coin. Where to begin? <laughs> now, to hurry before the wind erases the tracks. What's it look like it has a dick? What is that? Oh, it's not a oh, it's not a rock. It's a person's head and a little bit of his shoulder. I thought it was a rock. <laughs> I thought it was a rock with a dick. <laughs> oh, my bad, my bad, buddy. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, what happened to the other skull? Oh, it's right here. This is the skull we were. Oh man, I'm stepping all over that skull. What do you think? Looking, yeah, you guys couldn't get out, but I sure can. What happens if I pop a squat on my towel there? Yeah, you couldn't get out, but I sure did. <laughs> Alright, let's get on my horse. Alright. Fucking bird. I was like, how come the bird can't go call- What the hell? Damn. Definitely on some primo butt hash right now. Mr. Wizard's Resident Evil blend, for sure. <laughs> Resident Evil 7 blend. The hell is that? Oh, that's my... That looked kind of weird. Was that my bird's shadow? Whoa. So that guy must be the scarab then, huh? What am I doing exactly? Oh. Find and retrieve your gear. Alright, I can do that. No problem. 
<coughs> it's a really weird looking rock penis that we dealt with earlier. I must be careful now. Ah oh, shit. Oh shit, I gotta fight naked? Alright, I can do this. I still got my hidden glove. For some reason the guy was like, let's not take his hidden glove. Let's make him naked, but let's keep that hidden glove on him. What's up, Bexlorn? Please play a good game? Never. I don't think I've ever played a good game in the history of this stream. Can you recall a good game that I actually played, Vex? Tekken 7? Maybe Tekken 7. That's a good game. Other than that, though. Evil Within 1? Why are you a mod? How did you get to be a mod again? <laughs> that's right, because you've been here for fucking ever. That's right. You were drunk? Alright, that's a good explanation, too. You've been here for a while, and I was drunk. Those are good combinations. Probably get drunk tomorrow, too, when I go hang out with the guy and uh, watch some really whack-ass bands try and sound like Tool. Sounds like a good time to get drunk, too. Man, and on top of that, my fucking workplace wants me to go hang out on Saturday. I gotta do some stupid shit tomorrow, and then they want me to go over to this guy's place to on Saturday. And have, like, a luau or something? Who do these fucking guys think I am? Some guy who doesn't stay home and jerk it to cartoon porn? Like a normal person or something? What gives? Do they not know that I play video games? I don't get it. It's the weirdest thing. Fucking, what do they think I do all day? <laughs> you should not be here. Your mom shouldn't be here. Hey, give me my items. Uh oh. Something happened. Wow. That was unfair. Oh god, I just went in the cage. Get out, get out. Alright, naked man on the loose. Anything? Easy peasy. I have no idea. I'm a fucking master assassin. Are you kidding me? Fucking Hitman's got nothing on this game. I would legit not accept a out of workplace gathering. Seriously. It's like, I don't really want to do that. I don't, it's not that I don't like the guys. Everybody I work with is cool. They should have but I'm not into shots. that, man. I fucking, I want to, I, I like being home playing video games. And that's not like a stream thing. That's just a me thing. I, I wouldn't want to do that even if I wasn't streaming. I'd rather just be home. And it's going to be hot out, man. It's going to be like fucking... What? Oh, weird. I mean, it's gonna be hot. I mean, it's gonna be like 90 degrees or something. I don't want to be outside with that. There's gonna be bees and shit. And the bees are gonna smell the food and they're gonna be all wanting to chomp on my ass. Man, I don't want to deal with that. I don't even want to go to this bar tomorrow because it's gonna be hot there too. Who knows if it has AC? I mean, it's a bar, man. There's no way it's going to have air conditioning, right? I usually don't like my coworkers. <laughs> I value my time more than doing bullshit gatherings, right? I mean, it's not like it's a complete waste of time. I would just rather spend it doing something, you know, I really want to do. <laughs> if you heard of B, I will never watch again. Are you fucking kidding me? I hate bees. I don't hurt bees because as soon as you kill a bee... All the other bees smell the ble the bee blood and go fucking crazy and they start fucking stabbing everything in the, uh, all around them. They start stabbing everything. Are you kidding me? Fuck bees. Fuck bees of all shapes and sizes. Honey bees, yellow jackets, not bees. Fuck the not bees especially. Wasps? Hornets? Yeah, fuck all that. Fuck all of that. I'm not anywhere near that. Wow. 
Why are there people here? I can hit him, the bastard. I'll rally the troops. Got a lot of these guys. I don't. I don't want to deal with it. Hey, what got you? Wow, they saw me. I didn't know I was there. I was in the bushes. That was weird. <laughs> oh boy, it's lit. It's lit. Damn! Alright, let's keep this going. Oh boy. Damn. They won't let me do anything. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> Chain throw. Whoa. He's here! That's the main guy! Uh-oh. Oh, oh. Okay, this is getting nasty. Let's get out of here. Let's get some distance. Get out of the, get out of the lock-on. Stop getting hit by arrows repeatedly. There we go. I'll take it. Hey, hold on. I got you, dog. Damn. I got him. But I didn't get to do the overpower thing. Whoa! This guy's super buff. I'm out of here. By the will of Gennadios, you will be destroyed. Oh God! It's the fist guy. Oh, it's the fist guy. He can fist me. Oh. What the fuck? Oh God! It's gonna fist me. Alright, alright. Chain attack! There we go! Ooh, that guy did not give a fuck about all of that. Let's get my shield up. The hell was that? Desynchronized! Oh, he executed me! He fit. He pounded. He fit. The fist will pound. The fist pounded me. He pounded me with his fist. Ah, he pounded me with his fist. This isn't Neverwinter Nights. That's oh, loss. He pounded me with his fist. <laughs> fucking Christ! I killed the guy too, but then this fucking dude showed up, uh, pounded me with his fist. Idea. I think I just saw sexual abuse. Is what you saw. Sexual abuse. I didn't consent to any of that. Fucking crazy. This game is crazy. <laughs> I didn't consent. Do I need an attorney? <laughs> I think you come by rather expensive like hot sauce. Do you come expensive? Because I come apparently really cheap. Apparently. Because all it takes is a fist. <laughs> a fist and a good pummeling to bring me down. Come on. Die. I 
fire to the beacon! Who said that? You? Who's setting fire to a beacon? Braziers. Who fucking lit the brazier? Viper's tooth? Damn, I got a yellow one. That's kind of cool. Who lit the damn thing? Oh, that's what lit. Oh man, it's too lit. Any clue? Hey. Hey. Damn, the Braziers! The Brazier people are coming. You see all the Brazier people? There's like four of them. Look at that. Hey, hold on. Out of Damn, they saw him. Damn, this thing does no damage at range. Ah, and a fucking phalanx thing? Damn, who hit me? Ah! It's the fucking fist again! The fist is back! He's supposed to pound me some more! Oh, man. The fist wants to pound me. Oh, oh, oh! Okay, the fist is back, and the main guy is here, too. It's great. Oh, he's pounding me. Okay, that seems to be a pretty good tactic right there. That was a pretty good attack. God. God, get out of the way. Wow, we both whiffed? He's got a double swing, so I gotta be super careful. Chain throw this guy. Ugh. Nice, I got out of there. Alright, here we go. The fist the fist once delivered the pounding, but now I shall pound the fist. Check this out. I got some secret fucking jujitsu moves. Check this out. Secret jujitsu moves. Bam. Look at that. Can't do shit. And then can just go crazy on his ass. Damn, that sounded really nasty. He parried! Oh god. He parried into a guaranteed Okazumi. Look at how much damage he just did. The fist is gonna pound me. Not if I pound the fist first. Oh, 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 oh. Nice! Oh, I'll take that! Woo! Nice! Ooh! Ooh! Nice! That looked nice. Ah! Pounded the fist. Pounded the fist. Not too bad. Polygamy's fist. That took a lot of work. Styling himself as a Medjai. 
who sought for <laughs> crimes against the rule of our glorious Pharaoh. Not too bad. Oh, that was the main guy. So, this is how a dream dies. Crazy. I thought he was working for the guy I was I supposed to kill, but he actually is the guy I was supposed to kill. Hooper could have sung stories I'm sorry, it's, all these there black dudes kind of look the same to me. I don't know who's what. We all labor for higher powers. We are all <laughs> enthroned to greater forces. There is no escape. <laughs> like you were fucking him with a sword. It was pretty gross. It, it was very squishy and very wet, for sure. I am but one in the order of ancients. What's up with you? This victory! Will bring you no peace. It is no I like peace this soap opera seek. stuff that they do. It's not for my soul that I walk this path. The Order of Ancients will remember me as the bringer of waters <laughs> and the builder of cities. It, this is really cool how he like does a bunch of weird shit like this. Oh, the desert will blow in and scatter the dream of Metopolis. Like dust. <laughs> it's kind of like that scene in the. Uh, it's kind of like that scene in um. Devil May Cry Four. No, yeah, Devil May Cry Four, where he has that opera scene with that weird moth guy. <laughs> it's like they have that every time he has a boss thing. It's pretty fun. Oh, shit. Orders to kill me. Those who hold them must die before I do. Perfect. Why did my fucking... Uh... Oh, that's why. Right, there you go. Ah! Uh, <sighs> Take care of him. Try to make him understand if you can. <laughs> you have brought blood and death to my house. You are blind. But now you must open your eyes. Your husband was a scarab. He did this. Your father was tortured and scarred by this man. As were so many others. No! It is up to you to <laughs> raise your boy into the light. Out of the blood and shadows of his father's legacy. <laughs> I'm sorry, my son. So weird. Pretty good, though. Alright. Pretty good. I didn't realize he was going to be the guy. That's rather surprising. IS DNA has finished sequencing. We can Ooh. Sync with their memories now. All right. They're we can play as the chick now. But you should be able to dip in for a little while. I wonder what that is about. Is that going to be like DLC or? I walk on okay. your water. Weird. Oh. <laughs> I guess that was meant to be weird. I thought maybe a subtitle glitch. <laughs> so we gotta go kill some other people, but we're also gonna have to check out this chick's thing. That's kind of weird, too. Ugh, man, internet's too damn hot. I want to relax. Yeah, I don't think they ever will, man. They kind of dug themselves way too deep with the whole, like, animus bullshit. What the hell? Oh. You know, it does have some really nice-looking scenes, though. I gotta give it up for that. But then again, I thought... Black flag looked nice too, so what else? <laughs> Just like the Battle of Salamis, Captain. I have you trapped. <laughs> Here comes Themistocles. And that is the game. Oh. <laughs> what? Ah. <laughs> oh. Sort of loser. Shit. Foxy, that's why are we delivering all this treasure? We could retire to Lesbos with this amount of gold. <laughs> what say you Ooh. doing, Rats? If that chest doesn't make it to Pompeii, this ship won't either. We 
crawl through Hades to deliver it if we have to. Damn, she's pissed. Enough. Why? Back to work, you slack black horse! Demas this! My trusted shield boy, get to it! Huh? We've been hired to bribe Pompey, to save a queen, and to win a kingdom! <laughs> the usual fare for us mercenaries, huh? What is up with this guy's outfit, though? But yeah, the whole future stuff is like, we don't even need it. Especially after they were all like, hey, check it out, aliens, you know? <laughs> when aliens entered the picture and Desmond was excommunicado, I'm like, yeah, this game is done. They've got no idea what they're doing at this point. The best they can do is Strike stall. <laughs> Damn, we're playing as the chick, huh? We're actually controlling the boat? Nice. Assassin's Creed 4 style. So they actually made a game that was based on either this game or the last game's uh, sea combat thing. Naval combat. But I hear it's pretty trash. Like, it's not very good at all. I see the skeddies. Your third voyage. And already you bark like a command crew. I enjoy watching Spittle get caught in your beard, Foxy Das. <clears throat> Let's not be thrown into the sea. That's no death for such a hero as me. There's no cannons on this, right? Swim to save himself. I see them. I'll not be sucked to his cup. Actually, there might actually there might be cannons. It looks like those are cannonballs down there. Do they have cannons in this age? I guess they could. A normal entry in the series? No. It's an actual game that is just entirely about the naval combat. There's no assassinating at all. At all. Ptolemy's ships. Sent by the order of ancients, no doubt. What beat is do they have with Pompey? Pompey's armies will give Cleopatra the throne. They mean to prevent the alliance. They look really bad. <laughs> like it, it doesn't look like the even the naval combat isn't isn't very interesting. The thing is, is the naval combat in the games look really cool because of the water and everything. But like without the actual ass creating, I don't know why you would play it. The ass creating is what makes it so cool is that you can get off your boat and just go over there and stab them all. You know, the cool thing about that naval battle is that you don't have to actually play it like a naval fight. Just go onto the other ship and kill everybody. Sink the fleet? Oh, is that it? How do I fight? Oh. Incoming fire and it hold L1 the brace. Weak points. Triple arrow volley, hold L2, and tap R2 a bunch. Off the tempo. Arrows incoming. How do I do it? Like that? Go to how, can, how do I do that more? That's crazy. This is weird. We don't have cannons. We only have arrows that burn. Alright. Pick up the pace! Oh, the series being bad. Okay, I need more speed. Arrows incoming! Ramming speed! Oh. Damn! Firebomb! Damn! Speed up! Pick up firebomb! Why can't firebomb? Can I? Oh! I fucked up. Use the firebomb. Nice. All right. Let's go over here and shoot this bitch. Burn the sail. Now burn the boat. Ramming speed! Oh! Jesus Christ! Now... Firebomb. No firebomb. Shoot them with arrows. Damn. 
They all fell in unison. <laughs> all the people fall in unison. Be careful with your jibes, Captain. Pompey is a needed ally. Alright, I gotta be real. That was way worse than having cannons on the side of the boat. That was way worse than just having cannons on the side of the boat. Like, I see what they tried to do is mimic that kind of feel, but without having any cannons or any naval combat developed at all. That was way funner when you were pirates and you had shit that, like, belonged on the boat. That, that was really clunky as hell. It's hard to say goodbye to those who don't accept us. But he's also the only way. It does. It has some is cool it? historical shit. And it is production value. Yeah, the there's some redeeming team. factors to yeah. Assassin's Creed, but they are pretty shitty, though. I mean, the, the, the plays are pretty shitty. Ramming and counterfire? Sinking a ship by ramming speeds up reload. Hold it on the brace and release it just after enemy projectiles strike your sh ship? Weird. Ray! And then when they hit us, we let go. Brothers. I have some, all right, whatever. Speed up! More speed, settle! Let's get going here, guys. Jeez, this is a slow. I have to hold down R2 the whole time. I can't. Uh... Oh, speed! Oh, maybe I can go even faster with this. Off the pace, brothers! I can't tell. <laughs> I don't think it's any faster. Off the tempo. Or that, I see him. That yeah, maybe it Pompey is. Sends north. Don't rush! There may be patrols ahead. Are you ordering me away from a fight? Lady shit, of course not. But I am not keen to die protecting a Roman, especially one who can afford his own protection. You know. Fire bombs ready! Defend Pompey's Octoremi. Oh boy. Octoremi? Let's go! Let's fucking uh, smash into these bitches. Oh, we got we got shit coming. No, we don't. Hold the ram. Fire bombs. No fire bombs. No fire bombs. Yeah, how do you fire bomb like really close? There we go. Oh, shit. Nice! I countered attack. No, I fucking ran this bitch. Oh damn! I didn't. I didn't do it there. Ran this bitch. Fire bombs. Oh damn! You can't ram and fire bombs. They're not a lot. Bomb says you can't do both. Wow, that's a shit ton of damage. We We'll break them, or take them down with us! Fire! I can't tell what's my life bar and what's not. I have actually a ramming bar, it looks like. Yeah, this shit's getting crazy. Nice! Counter-attack! Ram this bitch! Dude! <laughs> this looks pretty bad. This looks pretty bad, which is sad because in the last games they, they looked really good. But having a naval sea fight in an era that doesn't really have a lot of like advanced ship stuff is definitely hurting this game right now. Brace! What did I brace? Oh, there's another boat behind us. God damn it. Can't even like board the boat as an assassin and like kill everybody on board. Now let's find this metro Yeah, shit's on fire, yo. I've never met the Roman general. Wonder how you heal. You actually lose ramming power when you ram. I didn't notice it. Isn't it infinite hours of Batman combat still? 
This game is different than Batman because in Batman you actually zip to the guy that you fight. And it's not that kind of uh, deal. It's actual hitbox and swinging of your weapons now. Well, we could have let you die. And even in the old ones, it was more about locking onto one guy and staying locked on and getting the parry into the guaranteed kill. Batman was more of a mashing square. Just mash square a bunch. And maybe a parry just to defend yourself. But it wasn't a parry to kill. It was just a parry to temporarily protect yourself. And that's it. And then if you got hit, reset your combo. That sounds worse. I mean, it kind of is worse, but it, Shadows of War is more like Batman. Because you do the same thing. You mash on your attack button. You only have one attack. And then you can hit, like, square plus X and do, like, a, an adrenaline move or something. It's not... It, it's more about combos and not getting hit ever. In this game, there's nothing like that. There's no combos. You just... Swing your sword, and you might be able to hit multiple people if you line it up right, and that's it. You know, certain weapons are good for that, and yada, yada, yada. It's kind of lame. I mean, I think both are kind of lame, because I used to like Batman style. But it's worn itself out heavy. It's heavily worn itself out. Everything under the sun uses Batman style mashing. So it's really boring now. Like... All brawlers are that way. <laughs> Even, like that Mad Max game that came out, exact same method. Exactly the same uh, Batman, parry, mash on square, God of War style thing. It's a God of War style that's just brought up another level because of the parry. You know. It's a, It was fun when I first played it, but it's definitely ran its course now. Assassin's Creed is trying to do something different, and so that's good. It's just really not well executed. I don't think. It's not It's not any more entertaining, and it doesn't execute very well. It doesn't feel good in the hands, and you know me. I'm all about controls. Like, if I can't get a good squeeze on my gameplay, I feel, uh, feel limited. Lackluster. There's a good chance I'm not going to enjoy much of anything about the game if, that, if I'm sitting there bitching about not being able to move when I want to, you know? This game's got a little bit of that, where you're just, you're kind of stuck in certain things, and it's... It's sort of hard to tell exactly when you can, like, do anything. You've been scratching yourself a lot, man. Do you have, uh, fleas or something? Do I gotta do something about that? Hmm. 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 I got. I might have to buy some flea stuff for this guy. He's been scratching quite a bit. So we actually played the chick, but that wasn't a choice. We were forced to play her. Hmm. You know, I'm not super happy with these uh, with these two weapons. I'm gonna see. If maybe I should. Maybe I should play with the. Uh, you know, the big one. <laughs> Copper mace. Oh. Well, I wanted to try the scepter. We haven't played with them yet. This seems like a weird weapon. I don't think I've seen this before. We'll try and play with the mace a bit. Mm. What are we gonna do now? <clears throat> I think we need to figure out our new quests, right? New kid in town? Yeah, I can't do that one. This one's hard to do because I don't know where to go. And I didn't look up where to go yet, either. So the hyena and the lizard mask. So those are... Okay, so let's go do the hyena. Giza, the meet the informant. Yeah, the hyena. Okay. I don't have any sides that I can do, right? Gotta get the Giza. Hmm. That's weird. That staff actually shrinks when you put it away. And it elongates when you swing it. That's so weird. Pretty sure this uses Denuvo on PC. Ew. 
that shit like hurts the performance of the games, doesn't it? Like every game that has De Nuevo or whatever is like really not good. Doesn't Tekken use that though? Shit, maybe Tekken does use that. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna run to this thing. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to hightail it towards our destination. I'm just sweltering over here, dude. It's just warm. It's just too warm. I can't stand this kind of heat. We'll follow the road. That way I don't have to actually play. It's great, isn't it? Vaxlorn, where do you live? You're not in Germany, right? That's Infected SA. Why are you going that way? That's not where my quest is. <laughs> Wisconsin. I hate this heat too? Shit, alright. So you're... I mean, in Wisconsin, is it usually pretty hot for you? I'm not used to the heat at all, but it sounds like maybe you're like me and you're used to the cooler weather. I mean, I heard down in California shit is like really burning up. Whoa. Not 90s? Yeah, I mean, it's fucking... It is 90s out, isn't it? <laughs> it's so awful. Yeah, I don't like it either. I like cold weather. I'm like, I'm a, I'm a cold person. It's just what I've always been about. I've always been down for the Seattle wetness, you know? The Seattle freeze. Give me 60s to 70s. Yeah, that's good. 60s, 70s. Hey, even 70s is still kind of warm for me. I, I'd rather have kind of cooler, you know, maybe 50s or something. I like it when it rains, but not too heavy. I like a nice, mild rain. And then, like, the off and on mild rain, that's a really nice one. Because then, like, if you actually need to be outside, you don't get soaked. But then you can stay inside and maybe catch a really nice drizzle to look at outside. Go do this. Side quest. I want thunderstorms. Thunderstorms are cool. Nastier the better. Sure. Those are cool, but I don't want to be stuck in them. You know? I don't want to be out and about. And I don't want to be at work when that shit happens. I'd be, I'm happy to sit at home and watch it all unfold outside. That is fun. Very comfortable. Very comfortable. But if I'm at work, no, nah, I don't want to go through that. I don't want to have to drive through that shit. Yeah, that's definitely not something on my agenda. Am I going the wrong way? I totally fucking am. I get so confused with this interface, man. What the fuck? I didn't know you guys were here? Damn, what the fuck? Woo! <laughs> that was kind of neat. That's sort of neat. You just gotta turn that on and get fucking uh, Shaolin monk style on that. I oh, kind of like that. So you know, uh, Vexthorn, you were talking about playing good games. How about For Honor? How about we play some uh, For Honor? That's a good game, right? I I watched some uh, hidden gameplay footage of the Shaolin monk who uses a staff for fighting in For Honor, and it looks really cool. Like, he's got some really cool-looking animations and stuff. I know nothing much about For Honor. It's a pretty trash game that's, like, really not well-balanced at all. Like, terribly. Really, it's terribly balanced. They don't even really think about balance. They, they release the new characters, and then they're just broken, and that's it. They just release the new characters broken. That's what they do. But it's still kind of fun. <laughs> I don't know. You choose a direction, and then you swing. And then you can parry it, you can block it. 
You can get some kind of cool shit. It's a little, it's a little neat. It's not quite a fighting game, but it, it's got some stuff to it that's sort of neat. You there? Is that a Magi badge? Over here. Yeah, it's going. Please, I am. The gods are smiling. You are a true hero. All right, where Keep am I going to take you? Head down. Travel to Giza for the hyena. Well, what about this thing that I just did? Wow, that was easy. Barely went anywhere. Freedom. You recover quick. Now, how about... have I helped another criminal? Oh, <laughs> I helped another I... criminal. You are a medjai. No, not a criminal. Uh, I know your kind. What did you? A ring of unparalleled riches. As you... me, hmm. I just. Yes. Hmm. Uh. Come to your yes. place. Damn, wants me to go to his place? What a all right. Treat. I thought you were all very beneath the sands of But yeah, mine. it's uh, gonna be getting some new Which DLC. One? And For Honor is gonna release some you Chinese warriors. Warrior like and one of them is a Shaolin monk, so it's kinda got my boner kinda into. sniffing around a little bit at it. Yes, it is hard out here for us, you know. Bandits are always up our asses. <laughs> then you should trade this ring and be done with it. I know, but... So I'm hoping so I kind of check that out, but they're going to be doing like a lot of different balance rewards, patches soon. Rewards. They're going to rechange my rewards. class, the Warden. They're going to rework the way the Warden plays. So I was thinking I should play the Warden ah, now in his palace. current state oh, so that when they Some do palace. release the balance changes, which I don't think it's too far from now, <laughs> I can kind of appreciate them more. My city. Ah. What is my sinny? Is that like calling the, uh, is that like an Egyptian version for my N-word? Okay, calm down. My Necker? From Witcher 3? Who is this? This is my brother. Gonna help us find the ring. Are you serious? Okay. Yeah. Why not? Yeah. I've got time. Ha! Luck is always on your side. Isn't it, Oba? Jesus Christ. If it was, I'd have my ring. Our ring. Yes. Yes. That ring is worth millions of drachmas. Cleopatra would lay you if you gave it to her. We should check Damn, our other you? brothers. They have the ring. There are bandits all around here. I'll start there. All right. Rashid mm. went south. Rashid cool. is in danger. I have to get him out of that bandit camp. Let's go free the guy. Free guys and uh, get rings. Why not? Very good. Very good indeed. These side quests are kind of whatever, but, you know, it's sort of fun beating yes, things up. And gives me XP, which is more important than anything. I gotta get more leathers, though. I gotta beat up on more animals. Are you an animal? Check it out. I'm gonna beat your ass. Nice. Perfect. Yeah, I need a bunch of soft leather in order to upgrade uh, one of my things. So more soft leather is good. I should have upgraded my weapon. It's kind of weak. I think I've over-leveled my weapons, or me, so now my weapons are under level, and I need to upgrade them. weird guy there, huh? It's weird that you use things like spears and this staff, and yet you still have access to your shield. That's a really strange layout. But I guess that might actually be historically accurate for the time period. Because they kind of did use shields with a lot of their stuff, right? Phalanxes and whatnot. Hey! Hey, hold on. Got Damn it. Got you now. Damn. I fucked that guy up. Hey.
Who saw me? Oh, he saw me. Kind of a lame one. That's not too cool. It's kind of cool, but not too cool. What's going on down there? Oh, they must be training. Ooh, hey. Nice. If I can help it, I want to kill that guy and keep the commander around. This game doesn't have nearly as many execute stuff as I wish it had. got me. Damn! That's so weird. You can't fucking break it with that. Oh, nothing? That was a cool kill, too, and everything. Oh, that was Commander. Damn. I still didn't get a cool assassinate? pretty good heavy strike. That's not too bad. I think I, uh, I think I like the spike better, but it's not too bad. That guy didn't drop anything, did he? What the fuck? There is a yellow guy and he didn't drop any loot. Hey. Someone oh, say something? What did I do to deserve this? Is someone there? Not getting any animations off the heavy attack. I guess it's only the light attack that you get a kill animation with this weapon. Strange. Yeah, that's one of the complaints. The game just didn't have nearly as many cool animations. They really cut back on a ton of them. I think if, uh... Unity had some really cool looking assassinations. That shit was wild. Like, they actually incorporated environmental assassinates and stuff. So if you did a knife kill near the wall, you, you would do like a spring kick off the wall with the knife. The 
<laughs> that shit was really cool. Unity had great kill animations. Then I think they kind of dialed it back for Syndicate. Because in Syndicate, they made it so that you had multiple kills. Like, if you had three or four people, you could initiate a three or four person kill animation thing. So you'd get like four people and it would just play out like a cutscene. I will go make sure he is all right. I didn't like that one so much. Because they removed a lot of the cool single person kill stuff in favor of having those multi. They still looked cool, but they got kind of tiring after a while. Got you! You will pay, Cobra! It seems like you can only get one move out of this thing. Hmm. It looks kind of cool, but you know, not really that cool. Everything at least had a little bit more than one. So I'm kind of surprised that this, this stick thing only gets the one. What happened? Oh, shit! Oh god, this guy's gonna fuck me up. And his horse guys are gonna fuck me up. Okay, let's get out of here. The time has come. No way you can run to. I'll find you. Ha! Mine now. Horse guys are really gonna fuck me up. Yeah, those guys. <laughs> when they're on the horses and they shoot you so freely with the arrows, like, there's not a whole lot you can do about that. Yeah, even with the heavy, we got this animation. Yeah, that sucks. It's a cool idea for a weapon, but it's it's not doing anything for me. Oh, my little pump you do poop. <laughs> oh, what's wrong, Duder? Hmm? Are you not getting enough hugs? Hmm? I can hug you more. I love hugging dogs. It's part of my deal. Yeah, I'm happy to hug. <laughs> Ugh, you're heavy though. When he puts you right, when he puts his weight right on your fucking shoulder right there, he's heavy. Oh shit! I was gonna change this dumb weapon. All right. Uh, you know, honestly, the hack and slash is kind of cool. I like this one, but I gotta upgrade these things. I like the hack and slash. Really, I just like the sword and shield, and I like the pike. The pike is cool. I should probably use the pike because it's easier to, like, clear out a room with the pike one. Have you ever had a rat on your shoulder for a full day? No, not for a full day. I think the max I had a rat on my shoulder was maybe an hour. Because after an hour, inevitably, the rat would leave a poop or piss on my shoulder. I'm like, all right, you're going back in your cage, buddy. <laughs> I used to play Chrono Trigger in my room, right? When I had little white albino rats and stuff. Just a couple. I only had two. But I used to play I used to play Chrono Trigger in nothing but like a pair of shorts. And I would just have my rat chilling on my shoulder or fucking around in my long hair, you know, even as a kid I had long hair. That used to be my night. Mostly naked, pair of shorts on, nice and breezy. Whoa. Just playing some Chrono Trigger on my SNES. Nice can of Diet Pepsi and a big ass white rat on my shoulder. 
And then we, we would just chill until he would shit or piss on my shoulder. And I'm like, all right, you're back in your cage, you go. <laughs> One of my best rats would just sit on my shoulder as long as I let him. Wow. Yeah, mine would come, mine would definitely tend to wander after a while, for sure. I had like this nice chair that I would play games on, and uh, occasionally it would like they would like to go into the chair and like get lost. I didn't like that because I felt like they were kind of tearing it up inside. It was a nice chair, and I also got scared sometimes that I might shift and move in a way that would stab the rat. Like, maybe a random coil would, like, pop out and kill it or something. I was terrified that I would do that. I had the same thing with a bunny. We had a rabbit that we would do the same thing with. And he would go underneath our, uh, couches and stuff. I was always scared that I would, like, move the couch in a way to squish the fucking rabbit underneath. Frightening. My shoulder would cramp after a full day. God damn. Yeah, I imagine it would. <laughs> Lucky hell, man. Did I not go the right way? What's the deal here? Oh, maybe I gotta go in here. Whoa. That was cool. Let me take the treasure. Nice. Hey, a level 22 predator, bro? Predator, bro? I'll take that. Did you hear that? Is that a snake? Hmm, that was weird. Let me equip that bow. That actually, I think that's better than what I had. My creator. Yeah, level 13. Where's that predator? Predator bow. Yeah, that's level 22. Oh, Hades? Holy shit. Nice. Do I have a cooler bow for this? Big hunter's bow? No. Light bow, yeah. Alright, whatever. Damn, and I just got a level 22 Hunter's Bow. I was just asking if I could get one. It's insane. Man, that's a lot better damage and everything. Hmm. This is a uh, Hunter's, right? So it charges? Yeah, good. What's this? Ah. His hand was eaten. Gross. The hyena must have swallowed the ring too. Ah, this is absurd. <laughs> this is kind of absurd. So what do I do now? Carry? Hmm. I used to have some snapping turtles, but not snapping turtles. Uh, what were they called? Red sliders. Red ears slider turtles. I think they were based off the same turtles that the TMNT turtles were. The problem is, is that they wouldn't snap, but they would bite. And so you couldn't really play with them. You couldn't hang out with the turtles, because they would just bite you. <laughs> that kind of sucked. That and they kind of have, you know, all sorts of weird greasy, gross shit that you kind of got to wash your hands if you touch them. That wasn't as fun. Turtles are cool to look at when they're just chilling around and eating in the, you know, the tank and everything, but, like, as actual pets, you kind of want something you can kind of play and interact with. You couldn't really do that with those turtles. They weren't happy. We had one bite a pencil in half. That was kind of creepy. <laughs> That's probably the weirdest one I ever had. Other than this one fucking bird that tried to bite the shit out of my ear and took a chunk out of it, I still have a piece of ear missing from that shit. Ridiculous. Shit. I better use the other one. Yeah, this. I'm just not doing enough damage with those little ones. I'm not doing enough damage because they're too uh, low level, I think. I gotta upgrade them. Nice. 
Nice. Confirm the kill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You laugh at that shit, of course. I was fucking like, I don't even know how old I was. I was less than 10. And the fucking bird was like a parrot or something. Big ass jaw. It could easily draw blood from a human adult male's finger. Easy. Could chomp on that shit hard enough to draw blood. And that bird fucking was angry 24 7. Always angry. And the fucking bird had this insane desire to perch itself on my head. And that's exactly what it tried to do. And I freaked out because I knew that thing was gonna bite. And as soon as it landed on my head, I was like, don't move. It's gonna bite. If I move. Because it's gonna try and find stability, right? Well, immediately it fucking ran right down to my ear and clamped on that shit like it was trying to eat some food. I swear to God. Like it saw a meal. And it was like, well, this guy's ear is definitely something to eat. So he fucking chomped right on it. Just gushed a big chunk of blood. Fucking huge chunk was just cut into. Ugh. My dad. I've never seen my dad laugh as hard as that in my life. He, is, he has never laughed as hard as he laughed when that happened. I have never seen a human being laugh as hard as he laughed. That, it was almost like... It was like a Roman Caesar overviewing the gladiatorial arena and like a gesture was getting eaten by a lion. He was laughing so hard. I couldn't believe it. Here I am like in immense pain with this bird trying to eat me starting with my ear. And my dad's just laughing his ass off about it. I didn't even move or anything. I just I stood held still because that's what they said to do. Still chomped the shit out of my ear. Fucking, I tried to kill the bird after that. I actually grabbed it off my head and like threw it. <laughs> I was so pissed. Did I just kill that bird? No. That bird doesn't even give a fuck that I just did that. Running what was going on there. Poor bird. Whoa. Fuck that bird. That bird was a piece of shit. And then later we got another Bunnies. bird that was not a parrot, but it was like a kinda me. like a parrot. But it was a much smaller me. beaked. That bird ring. tried to bite the shit out of me too. Oh, but it was way too weak beaked oh, and it couldn't do anything. And the ring? The one time it actually kind of hurt what me was it found like a, a hangnail or something I had on my thumb Did you and it like grabbed some I skin from my thumb and ripped it off. Did you not hear me? About I don't even know why that bird was pissed. Like it wanted out of its cage. You'd put your hand in the cage, it would, sli it would sit on your finger. You'd pull it out and you'd hold it for maybe about one minute. And then after that one minute, it starts biting your finger. And then you try and put it back in the cage. It doesn't want it back in the cage. It walks away from your hand so it won't go back in the cage. <laughs> Confusing, right? Damn, what the hell? I gotta actually give a ring to someone? Give it to the guy I found. Yeah, this guy. I should be on my way now, brothers. Are you not sad? Your friends have died. In Giza, a friend dies every day. Doesn't even matter who you give it to. <laughs> Damn, they're getting real frisky there. The ring. Weird. Is that it? Damn those two. I have to find a ring before they do. Yeah, Keep looking, eh? I'm sure it will pop up somewhere. Ah, I will never give up. Cool. Why is that glow? You see that question mark? It's glowing. Yeah, look at that. What 
What is that glowing for? All I really need to do is find a blacksmith. Get my gear back up the snuff. Get my two favorite swords working. What the hell? It's way down there. A hidden entrance. How long has this been here? Cool. Nice. Woo. Hey, I can't see. Um, oh. Nice. The first time we ever used the torch, Internet. Cool. We're in an actual tomb? What the hell? Sphinx passageway. Oh. A sphincter's passageway. Can I light some shit? No. Shit is not lightable. Speak to contract market. I don't know. Whoop! Wrong button. I thought I was holding the options ah, button. A dead end. It does not make sense. Well, there must be a way forward. Yeah, you actually, like, burn the cobwebs and stuff? That's kind of cool. Got anything cool in here? No? Hey! There's a hole! Nice! Ooh! Ye ooh! Whoa! Can't light any of the braziers, huh? Wow! Treasure! Prey A Turbo! What's this? A regular sword. <laughs> Just regular. Very regular sword. What's down here? You think there'd be some nasty shit in this place? Damn. And we can't even see, like, the roof or nothing. Oh, boy. This is a big room. But I think it just goes here. Oh, by a moon. What is this? Damn, what is this? Huh. Wow. That looks cool. It's a uh, Warhammer 40k tabletop. Look at that. Yeah, these guys, these Egyptian dudes, these black dudes were playing... Uh, Warhammer 40k on their pool table. Look at the terrain and stuff. They got the little pyramids and everything. Damn, that looks really dope. They must have had a fucking good time. Huh. Warhammer 40k, huh? I wonder what that is up there. Weird. Looks like we can keep going. Treasure. The hell? Ooh. Purple shield? Hmm. Can I... Is that any good? Might be better than my Aegis. Phalanx shield. Melee and damage absorption rate. Wow, that sounds pretty good. Melee and damage compared to range and adrenaline. Yeah, this actually is better. Cool. Alright.
But is there a way down to whatever that quest marker is? Doesn't feel like we discovered everything in here, but we must have because we got all the loot. There's no way to go further down to that question mark, huh? I wonder if this is something that, uh, Oh, wait a minute. We might be able to crawl up. You see that? There might be a might be a way up. Hey. Nice. This is kind of like an assassin's a tomb or something. Assassin's Creed tomb? Crazy. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> We're really climbing. These are kind of neat. You know, we haven't seen something like this before. We're actually exploring like a, a pyramid of some sort or something. Oh, but I guess that's it, huh? Neat. Secret passage. Well, that's cool and all, but uh, what do you think about that question mark? Damn, get up there. Has a hard time climbing it. Oh my god. We have actual pyramids now. This is the first time we reached this spot. Damn, we got two glowy question marks? What the hell is this place? Why are they glowy? It makes me think they're rare or something. Hmm. Vex, your day been going pretty good, man? It's been chilling out, doing whatever? Getting kind of close to this question Whoa. mark. You see that? <laughs> hey, tomb of Coffrey. Weird. An actual tomb again, huh? Sure, it's Thursday. Big Thursday. Almost done with the week. Yeah, that's always nice. Vexthorn, what do you do for employment, or do you have an employment? I always forget. Or rather, I don't ever really get to talk to you. This is probably the longest I've talked to you in a while. Usually you come in here, jerk some shit off, and then you leave. You've been uh, oddly attentive the last few days, though. I like it. I like the attention. It makes me feel wanted. I appreciate it. Hmm? What the hell was that? What the hell? Here. Call centers. Really? You and I do the same gig? We're call center stuff? Amazing. I didn't know we had that in common. Well, that's kind of cool in a horrifying way. Yep. Damn. Do you do it for a bank? Or is it some other gig? I was actually pretty curious about how, like, ooh. I was kind of curious what kind of, like, how likely call center where I do, how likely it is that it's kind of a crossover from other call centers. But it's probably not too much alike. Since, you know, I'm dealing with people's money. Ew. Health insurance. Okay, that's probably not... A whole lot of the same. Oh. Damn. The scarabs don't like, uh... 
don't like fortunes. I mean, people get pissed because I'm dealing with their money, right? They, a lot of them see me as an obstacle between me and their cash, which I don't really get. I'm not an obstacle, I'm like a facilitator. But for some reason, they get very antagonistic when they deal with me. It's quite sad. I'd say half of them are pretty chill. Health insurance, I wouldn't know what that's like. I don't know if people call in being pissed or what. Levers are affected by the weight of objects placed on each side of the lever. Is this a lever? Oh, it's a weird, uh, it's a boat. <laughs> what the fuck? What the hell? Some objects can be moved. Oh, like this thing. But why would I move it? I deal with doctor offices, so in theory it's more professional. Hmm. I guess people will still yell at you about how insurance isn't being covered or something. I can see that being an issue. Oh shit. Did I do that so that I could do this? Damn, look at this guy. Carbon crystal. Hmm. This is kind of cool. Tomb Raider. I didn't know these were in this game. I mean, I, I guess it makes sense, but still, it's kind of neat. I wonder what that is that I keep looting. Some random cash laying around, huh? Ooh, we hit the jackpot. Fucking dudes died with their money. What's this? Can't read that shit. Ancient writing from the old kingdom. Of course. Yeah, I kind of figure so much. Find the ancient tablet. Oh, wow, we got an ability point for that. So ancient tablets give us ability points. That's kind of nice. More stuff is good. And then we got all this cool loot. Nice new shield, huh? Didn't I already get a new shield? Range, resistance, and adrenaline on parry? I think I'd rather have the melee and the damage absorption. It's a little bit easier going for how I use the shield. A regular sword. <laughs> Just a regular sword. Mm. Which way did I come in from? I came in from here, so we're gonna go like this. There we go. You know, one thing I really hate about the, the call center, it isn't really so much... That was kinda cool. It isn't really so much like the people being dicks. Though that, that does suck. It's really more like having to wake up early in the morning so much. I hate that the most. I would be happy to wake up later so, and this ha work later into the day. I'd feel a lot better with that. Co-workers? Why is it, co why is it co-workers for you? Why would they even give you a hard time? I mean, call center stuff is just between you and the client, right? Why would co-workers factor into it? Weird. That's kind of a cool tomb that we just raided. Hmm. 
<laughs> Neat. All right. All right. Well, you know, I'm not going to get too wrapped up in that because we have quest things we need to do. Mm. Where was it that I was headed? I did the... Okay, I did the thing there. I think... Let's go get this uh, fast travel up here, since we're so close to it. Yipes. At least I th thought we were close to it. When do they not factor in? I mean, for me, it's more... For me, I never deal with my coworkers unless, like, I dealt with a client and they're like, Hey, did you help this person? What happened? You know, that's the only ever time. Other than that, I'll lean over and be like, Hey, what the hell do I... What the hell does an interest rate on a 19-month CD look like, and how the fuck do I know how much interest they've accrued since they started it? You know? Like, that shit. That shit is wildly maddening to understand. Because I don't get it at all. Am I going to be able to climb this shit? Damn, there's little, like, holes and stuff you can grab. Crazy. Man. Uh-oh. End of the line? Oh, no. We're good. End of the line again? Oh, no. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Ah, jeez. There's a hole here, but I don't want to go into that hole yet. Oh, shit. Okay. You can only run up so far, and then you have to have something to grab onto. Alright, that makes sense. Interesting dynamic here. Everything is slanted. It's not exactly a straight vertical. So you get a little bit more room. They get you let you sprint up and to the right and stuff. That's kind of neat. So I might be able to make this. Oh, fuck. Not quite. Alright. I bet I can make that one. Nice. That's really cool. You can kind of cheat a little bit. I mean, you know, obviously they meant for you to do it. It's still cool, though. Now, this part does not look like we can... I don't think I can do anything here. Yeah. Maybe like this? Aha! Uh -huh. Look at this shit. Man, this is a real long one. You practically have to climb the entire damn thing. Oh boy, get over there. Whew. Man, if you fuck up and you go down, you gotta climb all the way back up. This shit is wild. It's such a huge structure. I'm making you climb all over it. Yeah, the only time I have a problem with that, and it's not even really co-workers exact, exactly, but a lot of times I get, like, the local branches will tell people certain things. It's this really awful game that it's kind of played, where it's like, we try and help people, right? And if we can't help them, we send them to the local branch. And if the, lo if the local branch tries to help people, and if they can't help them, they try and send them to us. <laughs> it's kind of awful. That's really cool looking though. That's that was sort of neat. Why is the top like gold plated and the rest is not? Slide down the pyramid? Cool. Wait, don't make me slide down. What yeah. fool would set up camp out here? I should have a look. It said a camp out here? Uh, hang on. I want to find that hole that I skipped. Remember there's a hole? I think it's right here. Yeah, okay, we gotta jump on that hole there. So I think it's right... Shit. Is it this side? Yeah, there it is. Oh, no. Damn. Okay, hang on. 
Mm. I thought there was like a hole I could climb in. I was like, I'll skip that for now. Maybe it was just a grab point. Yeah, I guess maybe it's not actually a hole. Hmm. That maybe there'd be a way inside, you know? It looks like it might have been. Guess not. All right. Whatever. Mm, which way am I gonna go now? I guess I gotta get back to what I was doing, huh? What was I doing? Damn, there is a way inside. This guy's trying to say there is. The picture there. <laughs> That's kind of cool. I think I have to hold. Yeah, there. That way I don't grab stuff on the way down. of Kafu. Alright, let's check this one out too. Why not? We're here. This was kind of fun on the last one. This is just sort of like Assassin's Creed dungeon things. But less acrobatic and more like Tomb Raider. You can squeeze... <laughs> Reminder. Vexthorn. You can squeeze through this crack, if you know what I mean. Vexthorn, if you play your cards right, you can squeeze through this crack and all sorts of other cracks, too. Did you know that, Vex? You gotta play that, she gotta play that shit real smooth, though. Being a subscriber, uh, you can slide into this crack real easy. <laughs> they call that an easy-going entry. You know, being a subscriber, you kind of get free access to the crack. But, uh, you know, we're not talking about that only. We're talking about all sorts of crack here. Many different kinds of crack. You can slide in if you just play your cards right. Uh oh, what's that? Nothing. Never mind. Mm. Rope. Okay. Damn, that's a big hole. Ugh. Hmm. What am I gonna do here? I think I'm going to go down the hole. After sliding through the crack, I think I'm going to go in the hole. Damn, I got some goodies. Ow. Fucking broke my legs on that. It's really, like, misty in here, too. What does this Yipes! Mean? This door has been rigged with something dangerous. There's no way through here. Mm. Hmm. Crazy. No way through at all, huh? Even if I were to say... Mm, blow that shit up? Wow. That is a fucking strong door. Doesn't give a shit, huh? Yeah, alright. That door does not give a fuck. Is there a crack here? Nope. Hmm. So. Guess there's no neat little, uh... Shit. 
And I mean, he did say there's no way through. I guess that's, I guess that's a deal, huh? You think maybe this is a story-related thing? Sure wish I knew. I don't like giving up, but... You know, I don't... Oh, what was that? Oh, little rat. Cute little rat. How you guys doing? I don't like giving up, but I don't really see an alternative place to go. Unless I miss, like, a hole in the ground. Or rather, a hole in a wall somewhere. No? Are these rats, like, a suggestion that they're going somewhere? No? Damn. Damn, I think we're... I think we're done. Without some ability to get through whatever that weird door is, I don't know what we can do. So I went through the crack, right? Hmm. Okay, hang on a... Ooh. Hang on a second. If we go back through the crack... And then instead of going through the crack here, we go this way. You think maybe we got some shit going on there? Can I do something with this? Aw, oh, shit. I did not know I could do that. I can light the braziers. Oh, hey, check it out. This is another way to go. Damn, that was 200 bucks and some bronze in that bag. I gotta loot shit more often. What's this? Mm. While crouching. Yeah, okay. This looks really auspicious. Like maybe water's gonna go down it or something. something. Damn, another scarab thing. Anything else in here? <laughs> Nothing? There we go. Some weird ass treasure. I like this game that has like I like the idea of treasure, but Jesus Christ. <laughs> I like the idea of treasure, but this game tends to like give you items that are just the same item you keep looting, it's just a higher level of it. Or you could go spend money and level up the one you already have. It's kind of a strange system. It's like you don't really need any of the loot that comes out. Damn, are you looking at all these goblets? What in the fuck is all this? What am I stepping on? Goblets? Pewter plates and goblets and what is a man? A miserable pile of goblets. Break all the seals connected to its sealed door to open it. I don't I don't quite get what it meant by uh, anything really hmm. so it said something about a seal yeah I break all the seals on a door
Well, how do I know what a seal looks like? It doesn't let me climb upwards, so I guess there's nothing up there. Yo! Alright, those were seals, huh? Oh, wait a minute. Uh, are we done? Oh. Haha. <laughs> Alright. Put a bowl in here. <laughs> and in here too. What the hell? Damn, that's a really Ooh! Man, that is a lot of goblets! This guy must have drank and ate a lot of food before he died. Got all this loot. Oh shit. We read the, the template. Ancient writing from the old kingdom. Nice, another ability point. Didn't, don't even need to level up. Just get that point. That's kind of neat. It's neat, but again, like the loot, I mean, I just got a predator bow for the same level that I got for the other predator bow. You know what I mean? This one's not going to have any different stats or anything. It's just the same bow. Well, this is a purple hunter bow, though. So maybe that means it's better because it's purple. So that should be unique. Yeah, Wolf's Bane. Rare Hunter Bow. Charging speed and critical hit rate. Wow, I like that a lot. Hmm. Cool. That sounds really dope. So now I got two purples for my favorite bows. Predator and uh, Hunter. I got another, another outfit? What did I buy an outfit? I don't remember where I picked one up. Weird. Hey, do I have enough for this now? Oh yeah, I do. What about that one that I really wanted? This one. I need more light leather. Okay, I gotta work on that. I got another... Yeah, I just didn't really care for him. I already gained like a bunch of shit. Sea People's Blade works really well. Viper's Tooth. Technical and Deadly. Bleeding on hit, combo multiplier, and poison on hit. Wow, that's a pretty buff sword. That's not too bad, but I don't like the sickle sword, so we'll just get rid of it. The Hack and Slash, or the Jutes and Kimbre? Eh. The Hack and Slash is cooler. I gotta level them all up, but whatever. Legendary Heavy Blunt. Health on hit. Let's keep that one. Get rid of this stupid thing. Keep that. Nice. Did that give me enough for what I needed? No, I still need more leather. Is that leather? I really don't care about the tool pouch either. I got enough to do like a lot of things though. Yeesh. really up there now. I don't want the stabilizer gloves because I want to save it for that. I want the light leather for upgrading that thing so I get more health. Hmm. What's this? Hmm. Lore. Is this our exit? Whoops. This looks pretty good for PS4, man. They really did put in really, uh... Really tried to put in some good shit for it. 
Was I supposed to jump there? Yeah, you see that? This place is really deep, huh? Too deep, five me. Whoa! Alright. Am I going backwards or am I going deeper into the place? Well, I'm going somewhere. Oh, that's where I came from. Okay, so I totally came there. Alright, cool. The shit. I came, internet. Good deal. Came pretty good. What's that? That's another... Oh, that's the first one, right? So that silver... That glowy one must mean it's like a place to investigate to like... Get some shit like I just got. Alright, cool. But really, I really need to focus on getting the shit done. The hyena. <laughs> Fucking off doing some weird neat stuff. As fun as that was. I really need to find a uh, sword person. What's this quest over here? What's yours is mine. And what's mine is mine too. I get really distracted by all these things you can do. That's kind of the thing about Assassin's Creed, though. It just has a bunch of shit. Ooh, shit. Are you dead? Is you dead? We got I'm sweating good over here. <laughs> shit. I just got bopped. Wake up. Wake up. What luck you're all right. Here, stand up. Damn, I thought you were lying on it. Lying on what? What happened? My notes. I'm a geographer. Cortesius, nice to meet you. Looks like we were attacked. They emptied my pockets. Took my notes too. You might want to check your pouch. Ah. You too? I should have known better than to travel the desert on my own. I'm going to find those thieves. They ought to pray to all their gods that my notes are undamaged. Damn, Lucky this Greek guy's alive. pissed. What do you remember? Remember, I was clubbed <coughs> in the head. I only recall the sound of a horse galloping away. There might be tracks. Stay here. Ah, uh -huh, let me sniff it out. My medallion's tracks. glowing. You Must be magic. Be serious. Mm. Follow the horse tracks. I take it that's uh, are this fresh up here. And southward. If I am lucky, they have not yet disappeared beneath the sand. I mean, I don't have to actually follow the tracks, right? It looks like I can just go to the quest marker and we're good to go. Wait a minute, what time is it? Do you guys got the time? 12? No, 11. Almost 11. That's not too bad. The thieves fled towards those ruins. Whoops. Must be the horse the thieves used to escape. Through here. Alright. 
Ruins investigation progress. Oh. Oh, it's an investigation area. Okay, that's why. We're just sniffing around, seeing what's what. Hey, are you a kid? What are you doing here? What is a child doing out here? It is dangerous. Why did I whip out my torch? I'm just finding things for Anta. What are you doing here? Yes. I'm a mentor. Two hour stream and I haven't taken a break, huh? Came this way. Did you see anyone? <sighs> uh, no. No one. The you kids were the thieves. No. Um, I, mean, I could yes, tell now. Alone. That boy yep. is hiding something. The kids bumped me on the head. That's gotta be what they dude. You hear that? I hear like a ping? sure what I'm looking for. We found a kid. Oh, exited. Hmm. Some weird shit like this? Someone has dug their way through here. Too small for me. There must be another way around. I think I see that thing over there, so I gotta grab that. Maybe just walk around like this. Oh, uh, maybe not. It's all buried over there. Mm, maybe just around this way. Mm. Ooh, what was that? Carry. Wow. I can actually get these out of the way, huh? Nice. Wow. It fucking super teleported me in there. Hey, how's it going, kid? <gasps> it is odd for a child to be playing here, no? Oh, what do you mean? I'm looking for some stolen items. Looks like you could help me. I don't know what you're talking about. My child, you are not at fault. I am here to help. We hid it in Menkaure's pyramid. I'm sorry, we had to do it for Anta. I'm sure Anta is a good friend, but Giza is no place for such foolishness. All right. Explore the pyramid to recover the items. Explore Menkor's Pyramid. Menkor's Pyramid. Oh, that's over there. Alright. Doesn't look like I'll be killing nobody. There's no place for a sword. How am I gonna get in there? Did I already go in? Oh no, this is totally a different pyramid. Okay. Ow! Fuck! That wasn't that far, was it? Yeah, okay, it was. Jesus Christ. I'm just used to Shadows of Mordor, where you just never take damage. This is more like Dark Souls 3, where you just take a shit ton of damage to my, <laughs> in a very small amount of distance. Alright. Let us investigate yet another tomb. These are kind of cool. I sort of like being in here. It's a little claustrophobic, but it's neat. Actual exploration. And these are real tombs, too, you know? They fucking went and did the research. I wish I could light this stuff better. Ooh. Weird. If you do a heavy attack, he just drops it. Hmm. Two ways to go. There's a window and there's a stairs. It's probably the same way. No? 
No, it's definitely different. Something happened. Feather? Why did I get the feather? Hey, you've got quite the swing. <laughs> Just how many of you are there? Only my brother, sister, and I. Don't harm them. I'm the one responsible. I want the note you stole from the Greek geographer you knocked out. And I want my money back. We've given everything to the bandits from the hills west of the Hemon tombs. They have Anta too, and won't give her back unless we steal for them. Who is Anta? Our protector. We were going back to Memphis when they took her. If we don't do as they say, they will kill her. Bandits will profit from children. Make a Get your siblings and stay out of sight. You have my word. I will return Anta to you. All right. I love beating up things. I can do that. No problem. What's this? Oh. Mm, is there some more shit I maybe should explore? Or is this kind of it? Ooh. All right. A little bit. Man. Another purple hunter's bow. Give me, like, something different, all right? <laughs> So I already got Wolfsbane, and that is an obsidian bow. Charge shot speed's a little less, quite a bit less. And the critical hit is, ex oh, the rate, and this is damage. Every twang, eating a glass of crimson blood. Uh, shit. I think I like the Wolfsbane better. It's got more charge speed, it's max charge speed. And critical hit rate rather than damage. I'd rather get more critical hits than more damage and fewer crits. I wonder what that weird stuff is I keep looting. You think there's a uh, thing in here? No. Actually, it would be a great bow, though. It's a shame I can't, you know, really use it because I already got a great bow. Ah, okay, that's what that was. Kind of a cut. Not really a shortcut, but kind of something. All right, let's go kill some banditos. El banditos. Mm. Where's my horse? There's my horse. Where'd it go? Oh man, it's way over there. <laughs> it's way out there. Damn, he's sweating on his brow like I am. Shit's hot today. I can't wait till the weather kind of cools off. I don't really want to deal with bandits out in the open. They'll shoot me dead. I will deal with hyenas. They have pelts that I need. Yes, soft leather is really useful. Mm. This is another glowy question mark. I wonder if that's going to make me... I think it's going to give me another ability point if I do it. Wherever these guys are hiding out might be another tomb. good though ability points are definitely good you can actually like I think you can buy ability points which is really fucked up Whoa. you can actually buy game progression this is the camp where Anta is being held the children gave everything to these bandits so I should keep an eye out for Cortesios' notes hmm. Hmm. no trace of Anta or the notes the bandit stash is likely to hide it deep inside your hideout I just got the three, it looks. You know, I think I remember seeing this from, like, a trailer of some sort.
pirated. Nice. I don't really use the bow too much. It's kind of hard to aim. I'm not sure. There's no like auto aim assist or anything, so it's a little difficult. Aha. Uh -huh. Find the ancient tabernito. Yeah. So this is gonna be another one of these. That's cool. You think there's more bandits in here? And there's gotta be, right? This is oh wait. I don't even need this. What surprises you? Why does that surprise you? I don't, uh... I, was I surprised? <laughs> Hang on. Oh. Hmm? Hey. You Damn, he saw me right away. Damn! He fucking threw fire at me. Shit! Oh, that was way more than I thought. Oh, boy. That is a shit ton more dudes than I thought. That's a hell of a lot of dudes. Are you kidding me? Get that fucking shield down, buddy. Damn, he got right through it. I like the shield. Sword and shield work really well. Damn. Nice. The animations for it are pretty good, too. The buying progression? Oh, yeah. No, yeah, it kind of does surprise me. Ubisoft is really fucking horny about that shit, though, so it should. But it's such a just scummy thing to do. <laughs> it's so scummy. It's like the this, this is what we live in now, right? A world of microtransactions. You think I can get this guy before he sees me? Wait a second. Nice. Hmm. No, I'm gone. Doesn't seem interested. There we go. Be on my guard. Damn. Damn, I couldn't even parry it? Couldn't even parry that? Wow, he's counter buttoning me right now. He's hitting every button in the book. Countering every button I press. <laughs> Whoa! Damn, he didn't give a fuck about that. Jesus. Look at all that fire. Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus. That got kind of crazy. But these guys don't ever seem to give a shit when the fire's running. It was just like, whatever. Excuse me. Fucking hell. Allergies are playing up like crazy in this warm weather. 
What the? You hear that? Oh, it's a puppy! Of course. You're Anta, their protector. Damn, you just pushed me around. You know your way back. <laughs> Looking for a fight? Come on, girl. Hey, I didn't... Uh, I didn't find the thing. I didn't find the thing. You know what I mean? So, Anta, you are a protector too, huh? Shit. Exciting. I didn't find the uh, special thing. You know what I mean? The really good stuff. You will see them soon enough. Thought maybe it'd be up here, right but behind you guys. Ooh. Could be somewhere in here. Nice. Let's go back up. Cool. Nice little area. Nice weird tree. What's that? Aha. Carbon and some other thing. Mm. You. <laughs> Yikes. Mm. Huh. Awkward. Letting me up here, but I don't think I want up here. Yeah, I don't think I want up here. Hmm. I guess this was just an extra. Alright, cool. Come on. It's weird how the game brightens up when you go underwater. <laughs> I guess they have to. I mean, otherwise, how are you gonna see? The torch isn't exactly going to work under there. Alright, alright. Before we go uh, do the dog thing, I gotta go do this counterbalance thing over here and see if there's a further way in. Might be inside a little bit more. I gotta go. put this one over here. We'll go put two on this one and see what that does. Yeah. We'll do that there really quick. And what's up in here? Just some money. Alright. And then if I go over here, jump up here, still getting the same thing, huh? I guess I need more of these weights. I wonder how many I'm looking at. Probably the whole deal. The game is trying to insinuate that I weigh as much as all these. So is the game calling me fat, Bex? I think the game is calling me fat. Why is the game calling me fat, bro? That's just mean. <laughs> it's calling me fat. Nah, it's not calling me back. Is it calling me black? Because that would probably be accurate. Since I am playing a black guy. <laughs> Looking light this damn thing up already. Jesus. Uh, Alright, we got some weird loot. 
Got a weird chair. We got a weird crock. It's a weird cock. Hey, we found the thing. Ooh. Your face is fucking wild. So a crocodile god. I guess that's real, huh? Jeez. They actually put this thing way up there? Hunter's bow. Man, we got nothing but hunter's bows out of this place. Out of all these pyramids, they've just been nothing but bows. Damn! Hold on, we got a new dual sword. We got another dual S word. Don't go to the shop. <laughs> Fucking game always wants me to go to the shop. Where is that? Uh, yeah, mirror blades. Very fast, short reach. Same with the hash, ha ha hash and slash. So two adrenaline, two crit hit, adrenaline regen, and eh. not as cool as the. I think I tried using uh, these once before. They didn't look as cool. Yeah, they're a little too thin. Yeah. Well, eh. We'll use them for now. We'll use them for now, but, you know. I don't like their look. New shield? That might be something. A carbon crystal. I think that's like pay to win money or something. I don't know. Ancient God, it's getting fucking hot in here. In the old kingdom. There's like sweat accumulated under my titties like crazy right now. My titties are so wet it's not even a joke. Alright, well we did what we needed to. Is the dog gonna be out here or do I need to go the other way? There he is. Dog's cool. What time is it? 11 17? Yeah, okay. Hmm. Alright, we need to get out of here. Which way is out? I think it's the other way. Mm. Oh wait. It says escort back to the children. Oh, okay, cool. He's leading the way. We good. Adorer of Thoth. Man. Wild names. Come on, Poochie Dog. Looks like a greyhound, doesn't he? It's my horse. There's my horse. All right, let's go, Pooch. Let's get that ass band. Oh. Are you gonna lead us to the? Wow, this dog does not want to move. All right, come on. Yeah. Let's go, buddy. What the fuck? I oh, because we're out, out here. Sight. I know, but this was our fault, and we thought you could use some help. The horseman is much, much bigger than you. Horseman? You haven't seen him? He's the most harrowing of them all. Big and strong. He's the one who took Anta. Hmm. He might have Cortesios' notes. I have seen him in the ruin. I will take care of this horseman. Kufu's? Now. I already went to Kafu, so I, I can actually just kill the, the guy. I can finally find those notes. Mm. Damn. Do I wait for this horseman to come back to his cave at night? Or seek him out as he roams and terrorizes Giza? I don't know. Kidnappers should be roaming around the pyramids of Kafu. Yeah, I totally did Kafu already, for right. sure. I did the two big pyramids, is the thing. But if I don't have to go in, that'd be really nice. Ooh, hyenas. Uh oh. I need a better sword.
Nice. Yeah, bring them all. We need all these. Guys. There we go. Perfect. Nice. We might actually have enough soft leather. Is that leather? Hey, have a good night, Vex. Thanks for hanging out tonight, man. It's good seeing you. Damn, look at that. We perfectly do. All right. Let's take a quick look at my chest piece here. Like that. And let's see what changes. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell. <laughs> Damn, I still need soft leather? Shit. This game is really demanding. Whatevs. What do you need? Let's go ahead and do that. Oh, wow, that blue stuff was actually a thing I needed for that. Crazy. Hmm. Should probably stabilize your gloves some more, but it's too much money. Vex, thanks for hanging out, man. It's always good seeing you, bro. Uh, best of luck tomorrow, man. We gotta get through our call center day. Keep the hurry covered. Eat this shit. Man, none of that worked. Yeah. Really unwieldy trying to do shit like that. <sighs> you know, it's pretty quiet tonight in chat. Maybe I should just call out an early night so I can get some sleep. It's almost 11.30. Would be kind of nice, you know? I don't have to go into the pyramid. That's good. It would be a little awkward if I had to. See these. All right. <clears throat> I think what I'll do before I call it quits is I'm gonna teleport over to some sort of a blacksmith and get my shit repaired. I think that's a good idea. stuff back to Paisus, I can't believe it I owe you my life interesting hey the puppy is back. it over all the bandits gone and they won't bother you anymore so you can stop bludgeoning people over the head now are these the thieves <laughs> easy friend there was a misunderstanding their hands were forced. And these kids need a safe passage back to Memphis, right? Yes, to the house of Neff, with all the other children. I have not yet mapped out Memphis. It was supposed to be my next stop. Do you know the way? No, but they know their way around. What luck. Come along, then. Uh, Memphis? Ah, yeah. Of course. <laughs> Thank you. Damn. 
Friendly Greek man. <laughs> this should be interesting when we Can take over in the next one. Or take over into Greece. Is that where we are in the next one? I think it is. I didn't realize the Egyptians and the Romans or whatever got along. But maybe that's just for this game. I'm not sure. Ooh. The dog's still chilling with me, huh? Oh, he's out of here. That's a nice doggy. Alright, good shit. Uh, what do I want to do now? Let's check our abilities, man. We fucking... N seven points. Yeah, okay, we got some shit. Mmm, shield charge. For two points. And loot for three and six. Ooh, I can only have one. You always start a conflict with a full adrenaline gauge. Hmm. After melee and kill an enemy. Yeah, alright. You always start with a full gauge. We'll do that later. Hmm. Yeah, we'll do that next time. Then I also want to get one of these. For one point. It's going to be acquired multiple times. Hmm. Not sure what I'll do about these. Fire damage is increased by additional 50%. That's pretty good. These all look pretty decent. Rare quality gear in shops. Yeah. All right. Shield mode. When in shield mode, you run faster and bash enemies on your way. This shield mode. I need adrenaline first. I think that's why I'm just doing the shield swipe. But if I had adrenaline, I can hold it down. You'd bash into people. All right. Uh, that was a side quest, right? Yeah, I think so. So, what's the main quest about? A hyena. You want me to go down to here? I can do pretty easy. The problem is, is can I teleport here easy? Not really. Not that easy. I'd have to teleport to here and then run. Well, I guess that's not that bad, though. Yeah, okay. Let's go back uh, to somewhere that's going to have, like, weavers and stuff. Like, right here. That way I can go take care of my gear and all that stuff. I'd like to upgrade my S word at least. Yeah, I like this one the best so far. Sword and Shield works out pretty good. This has the most useful move set. Feels the best. Welcome to Litopolis, final dream of the late Tahaka. So where, uh, let's see, it looks like behind me is going to be some. Welcome, Nebet, the city of Egypt. Right? Oh, wrong way. There it is. Blacksmithery, that's what I need. I think I already have the really fast horse, so... Not really a big need to buy anything else there. How's it going, buddy? Come to trade then. Refill anything that I'm low on. Yeah, I got some money. Let's go ahead and sell some shit in case I have things I need to yeah, get rid of you. Mm. I wanted to keep the copper mace and the plum. Get rid of the obsidian. You be in. Yeah. None of these really help, even if I were to dissect them, I think. Uh, mostly because I think I already got plenty of wood. Damn. Aldebaran? Alright. Creators. I 
right. Cool. All right. Golden bolt. <laughs> Down will sell all unnecessary items. Let's try that. Mm. Nice. Cool. All right. So uh, let's see. Is there anything to buy first off? Sea people's blade. Already got one. Okay, there's really nothing I care to. Let's do a upgrade of the ones I do got. So a thousand bucks to upgrade this. Yeah, all right. Nice. Then I wanted to upgrade the hack and slash. Super nice. I think really that's it. So let's go ahead and the gear. Yeah, switch you over to the hack and slash. It looks cooler in my opinion. Did that say I had the ability to upgrade my armor again? Oh no, that's something else. I need a lot more leather. I gotta kill like animals or something for that. How can I help you? Uh. Mm, I don't really need any more cash exactly, so let's go ahead and from here on, for the next foreseeable while, I think I can just get rid of. I think I can just dismantle stuff. I wish I could keep some of these things, but I don't ever want to use them, so. I'll keep the I'll keep a spear around because a spear actually was fun to use. We got you. I think Black Arrow is the fastest guy around. Am I happy with the outfit? Do I want to change it? Bags. Kind of miss the old stuff. Egyptian wind. Hector. I hate the ones that reveal the nipple. Kind of like this one. What does that look like? Kind of a blue color. That's sort of nice has a hood, right? Huh. Looks all right. Hmm. Kind of like it with his hair back on. He looks weird with his hair but without his beard. I don't know why that is. But when he has his beard back on, he looks a lot better. His hair and beard is a great combo. <laughs> he actually looks really funny without... With being clean shaven, he looks like really weird to me. I don't really get that. I don't know why. It just looks strange. It looks like he's wearing eyeshadow. When he's not ha when he But when he has hair on, it doesn't look so weird. He looks like he's wearing makeup. Right there, he looks like he's wearing makeup. But then when you put, like, the hair and everything, it doesn't look like makeup. It looks like shadow or something like that. It's weird, right? I don't really know why that is. Looks like Hell Pockets. <laughs> Looks kind of like Hell Pockets. I don't know. <laughs> I like this outfit, though. It's a little too blue, but it's kind of nice. Mm, doesn't show the nipple, either. What about this one? Yeah, this one's pretty cool, too. 
Sucks that you don't have any armor, but that's okay. That's not really the deal in this game. Marauders, garb. Yeah, that one's sort of lame. I like the mask over the face. That's kind of cool. Protector doesn't have any... Yeah, Protector's basically the Baic. How do you look with that on there? Yeah. Yeah, the nipple armor is sort of wank, sort, sort of whack. I'm not really into it. But I like the Persian garb. It does look cool. Yeah, but I'm getting a little sick of it after a while. Either Egyptian win or Egyptian Ertu. I guess I'd be willing to do this one. That's kind of cool. <sighs> this one's kind of nice because it's got a, a little bit of different color going for it. You can actually see some color coordination going on. The other one's just too blue. There's too much blue to it. Whereas this is the same thing, just a little bit nicer colors. Shared colors. There's some red and some blue and some white. I wonder if the Weaver's got a different suit, actually. Maybe there's something over here. Yeah, I like the other suit. I like the Persian suit for the armor, but we've been using it for a bit. It's kind of tiring to see. And I, I don't like this because it has the titty armor. Egyptian hedge? Rather distinguished outfit, though still suitable for the demands of everyday life. This one might look kind of cool without the hood on. Let's take a look. Not too bad. Looks a lot like the one that I have, just a little bit different. I guess it is the one I have, it's just different color. Hmm. Not really sure. I'm not really sure which one I actually want to use. Let's try using this one for a bit. This one seems to strike me as a nicer kind of blend of stuff. For the time being, at least. Although that last one had a kind of a cool look to it, too. I like the uh, color coordination of this one is all. Especially with the bracer and stuff. Looks nice with the bald hair too. The city of Egypt's future welcomes all. Alright, cool. Well, I got my gear sorted out. That's what I was trying to do. And I gotta go over there, so... Let's go ahead and fast travel to here, and then I think I'll call it. Internet, what time is it? 11.40? Alright, this is a good time. Listen. Thank you guys very much for hanging out. I think it was probably a pretty quiet night. I think it was just Vex. But uh, I appreciate it nonetheless. Had some pyramid searching. That was kind of cool. Ran around, stabbed some dudes. Get a little bit more familiar with the weapon here and there. It's kind of an okay outfit. I wish I had... Uh, access to maybe some DLC stuff or something, but, you know, I, I like the game, but I don't like it enough to be all that about it. So I'm not going to worry about it. Let's... Hmm. I guess we can just quit here, huh? What's this ranged? Oh. 
Hades and Wolfsbane. Cool. Well, I actually have two Wolfsbane. I didn't know that. <laughs> well, let's dismantle one. Perfect. Yeah. I mean, I need the wood, I guess. Probably. Yeah, I'll try and dismantle stuff from here on out. Since, uh... Should be looking pretty good. Long reach, average power. Right now, we have our Roman troops. Cool. Cool. The hack and slash is a really cool one. Alright. Internet, thank you for hanging out. Appreciate it. Uh, if anybody is new, I always appreciate them follows. And, uh, yeah. I'll be back tomorrow. I'm gonna go sweat my balls off while trying to get some sleep. Get some work tomorrow. Oh, no, you know what? I might not be back tomorrow. So, oh, man. I don't really want to do it, but I'm gonna go hang out with a buddy of mine tomorrow at this concert thing. I was hoping I could hang out with him at, like, I don't know, a place to eat, but... He's really into music shit, and he wants me to see this Tool tribute band really badly, so I, I gotta do that. I gotta do it. Social obligation. But, I'll probably be back Saturday. I don't think I'm gonna do that work thing with my coworkers. I'm just not into that stuff, you know? And it's gonna be Saturday. It's gonna be hot, man. I'm gonna be sweating my balls off, so I just, I just wanna chill. I just wanna chill. Whew, it's gonna suck. Anyways, listen... I'll catch you guys later, all right? Probably Saturday, maybe a real late night Friday gig. We'll see how the day plays out. I mean, who knows? But I'll catch you guys later. Thank you very much for hanging out. Have a good night. Try not to get too sweaty. I'm already too sweaty. <laughs>